Hello and welcome to the tutorial on more than and less than. In this tutorial we are going to do tens and we're going to do numbers 20 to 50. So let's have a look at our first Let's have a look at our first example. Imagine if you have this number. You've got this number here, 42. So we've got 42. And what we're going to do is we're going to work out what is 10 more than. So 10 more than. How are we going to do this? Well, let's have a look at number 10. Don't forget, this is a unit and the 1 is a 10. Now if it's a 0 for the unit, the unit should not change. So this 2 over here, which is also a unit, should not change. It is the 4, which is a 10, which is going to change because of this. So let's write this down. We've got 42. It's more than, so we're going forwards. Don't forget, this 2 is not going to change. So we can write that in. This 4 is the number that is going to change because of this 1 over here. And what we're going to do is, because it's more than, we're going to count forwards. What is 1 more than 4? Well, 1 more than 4 is 5. And that is our answer. It's as simple as that. On this side, let's have a look at 10 less than. So what is 10 less than 42? Now exactly the same principles apply. The 0 is a unit and the 1 is a 10. So because of this 0, the number 2 here will not change. So let's write this in 42. We're doing less than, so we're going to go backwards. So this number 2 is not going to change. So let's write that down. So the 2 is there. We've now got to work out what this digit is over here. We've got 4 and we're going to go back by this 1 over here. So what is, so we start with 4 and we're going back by 1, so counting backwards the number is 3. And that is our answer. I'll just go back a bit and I'll put the tick to one side. Okay, so we've done that. Again, nice and easy. Let's have a look at one more example so that we fully consolidate our knowledge on this. Let's, let's suppose we have this number. We've got 39. 39. On this side, we're going to do 10 more than. 10 more than 39. Well, we're gonna, we start with number 39. We're doing more than, so we're going to go forwards. We're going to count forwards. This 9 is not going to change because this is a 0. So I'm going to put the 9 in straight away. And as for this 3, well, this is going to change because of that 1. It has to go forward by 1. So counting forwards from 3, the answer is 4. That is correct. On this side, we're going to do 10 less than. So what is 10 less than 39? Now again, the same principles apply. Let's do this. We've got number 39. We're doing less than, so we're going to count backwards. Now we've got a 0 here. That's the units, 0. So this 9 is not going to change. So we can put that in straight away. As for the 3, that is going to change because of this 1. So counting backwards, 3, we're going to count back by 1. 3, the answer is 2. So 10 more than 39, the answer is 49. 10 less than 39, the answer is 29. And it's as simple as that. And that is how we do more than and less than of tens 
with numbers from 20 to 50.